awesome. So this is basically how to make the text move. Now we're gonna put the explosion on it right when the text is fully in the screen. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna just move up a few keyframes like this until the screen, until the text is fully on the, in its original size on the screen like so. What's happening guys, my name is Alex and welcome back to a brand new Vegas 15 tutorial and in this video guys, I'm gonna show you guys how to create an awesome intro. So if you guys want to see how to make an awesome outro, make sure because tomorrow I'll be dropping the video about how to make an awesome outro. So if you wanna see that video, make sure that you stay active, stay subscribed and I would say let's get started. So as you guys can see right now, we're in Vegas 15 and basically the concept of the intro is gonna be really simple. We're gonna make our name zoom into the screen while the name is zooming in. We have an awesome explosion and we have some awesome music playing throughout the video throughout the intro so I would say I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to do that and all the essentials that you guys need in order from from the music until the explosion that I'm using uh, well everything will be in the description and the link you can find all the downloads there and then you can just go ahead and download it so I'm really excited right now that's why I'm making fire so I would say let's get started so as you can see right now we are in Vegas 15 as usual and right here this is the explosion of well this is the clip of the explosion that we're gonna use So that looks really cool and as you guys can see right now we're gonna make the and we're gonna use this in our intro so we're gonna start off with the text pretty straightforward go to media generators scroll all the way down until we see titles and text we're gonna drag one guy into our timeline right here as you can see and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna type in our YouTube username that's a pretty pretty obvious choice so what we're gonna do is we're gonna click on there and then as you can see it's a sample text we're gonna double click on it and then we're gonna just type in our YouTube name in this case it is just Alex Halford Obviously, we're gonna make this a little bit smaller. Let's say that we're gonna put this one to 20. Uh, I think that looks pretty cool. But what we want to do also is we want to change the fonts because if we're gonna use this font, it's gonna be pretty straightforward and pretty basic, nothing really too special, and it's, it's not gonna impress anyone. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna go look into the font list. I downloaded many fonts uh, of, the, of the website defont.com, and you can just you know download them all the way onto your computer, or you can just download some font you know packs you know they, they are like folders including like 5,000 fonts so what we're gonna do is we're gonna look for a really nice font I think this one looks pretty cool it is called Bebas I don't know how you want to call this but that's what we're gonna use to create our intro now what we're gonna do first of all is we're gonna animate our text and we're gonna make this text uh, come into the screen like this like doosh. so what we're gonna do first of all is go to this little icon the event pan crop and we're gonna use some keyframes and some masking uh, just to make this appear. So what we're gonna do is the starting position at the bottom as you can see on the left Is we're gonna make this as big as we possibly can because we want the text to be really small And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna place a keyframe around right here And we're gonna right click and click on restore now if I click and you know play the video This is what the text looks like the text is zooming in really slow So what we're gonna do is we're gonna bring this keyframe uh, keyframe closer to the beginning that's gonna make it zoom a lot faster and as you guys can see that looks pretty awesome so this is basically how to make the text move now we're gonna put the explosion on it right when the text is fully in the screen so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna just move up a few keyframes like this until the screen until the text is fully on the in its original size on the screen like so then what we're gonna do is we're gonna match this explosion with the text. Now in order to see through the explosion with a black background is we're gonna go to this icon, the compositing mode, put that one to screen and as you can see, boom, we can see through the explosion. Pretty cool, pretty straightforward and let's go ahead and time it. Okay, this looks pretty cool. As you can see, the text is zooming in, and boom, right when it's uh, finished uh, zooming, the explosion happens. And right here, what we're gonna do is we're gonna add in a nice song. Obviously, it's going to be copyright free, because if you want to monetize your videos, it's pretty obvious that you want to use copyright free music. So I'm gonna just drag in a copyright free song from NCS, which is going to be this one. Pretty cool, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna look for this for the drop. This is the 
drop. Let's cut it right there. Let's go ahead and let's time it with the explosion like this. Boom, that looks really nice. But what we're gonna do, what we're gonna do then to end off the outro is we're gonna look for the last part of the song. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna cut it, remove the middle part of the song, and we're gonna time it until it sounds right. That's really how, how fast it goes and how amazing it is. So it sounds really timed as well. We're gonna make a little nice fade out with the text, really simple. And what we're gonna do then is we're gonna add in some light leaks as well to spice up the video. So let's drag that light leak in real quick. Okay, so this is the light leak. I'm gonna delete the audio. So what we're gonna do, oh, I don't need that. Let's go ahead and place it right here. And let's make that um, light leak appear above the video. Insert a new video track. And we're gonna time that one with the explosion. And obviously we're gonna click on screen, uh, I mean screen, so we can look through it. So this is basically how it looks. When the music stops, I'm just gonna make also uh, that uh, light leak stop. Also, I'm gonna, gonna make the text stop. I think that will re look really cool. So let's go ahead and remove the fade, put, put this guy against it. And this is basically our intro that we've come to create. So that looks really cool guys, so this is how to make an awesome intro and if you guys think this is not a cool intro, let me know in the comments what kind of intro you want to see and I'll maybe uh, make a, another video how to make a sick intro, how to make a cool intro, something like that. So that's this video for you guys, that was freaking amazing, I want to thank you guys for watching, thank you for the continuous support and I'll see you guys uh, tomorrow with a brand new video how to make an awesome outro and also in two hours about how to make your videos look like a Hollywood film. So make sure to stay tuned, in two hours there will be a new video and obviously tomorrow uh, obviously as well. So thank you guys for liking, thank you guys for subscribing, and I will see you guys very soon. Just Alex Halford.